Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on when you're watching this. And welcome to Timber and Stone. Here we are on the morning of day 24, and we are currently in the process of finalizing some, uh, what's the word I want to use, pre-preparations before we look at building what the main focus of today is going to be. And that is the new front gate of my house, slash settlement, slash whatever you'd call it. So I've cleared all of this out, and I've been having a few ideas about what I want to do. Um, most of this is going to come through just kind of, let's see what happens. Giving you trees to chop, which is good. During the uh, the evening, while I was playing through in order to get through to the point where it's light, um, I had two migrants arrive in the night, which is very nice. Um, one of which is just temporarily mining. There you go, Clarice. So there's another woman arrive. Actually, I think both of my new immigrants are mining here. Now, Clarice is a hard worker, so she should level up pretty fast. And then here's Sean Pelkey. He also arrived in the night. And he is also mining to help with this point, or get to this point. Also puts together a bit more of my next, or the next house for one of my people. Probably going to give this this house to Oliver, um, simply because he uh, he deserves it. Let's put a cloth bed in here. Let's put your bed by the door. You're my wood chopper, so you're also going to want a small table. chair as well. There we go. That should be good. Set the ownership to Olivier. And although he doesn't have a roof on his house yet, I'll come to that. I don't... Uh, Let's just test the water. Have I got a builder laid out? Because I don't really want to have a builder. Let me get the run number bricks I don't really want to have a builder just yet. Weird. Um, because I want to try and sort of design my new keep first. Yeah, I have got a builder. I thought I did. I'm on to you now. I know what I can do. If I put you on here and then take your ladder off you, you can't get down. So you'll work on these. But you can't get down, Mr. Superman. Remove and unequip. Boyakasha. Wow, I haven't used that word for about 10 years, and there it came. So, I was thinking, because of the problems that I'd had with um, enemies getting to my doors, I would have the door sort of sunk back a little bit and then I'd have sort of the walls pulling forward meaning that the guy the archer that's going to be stood just on the corner here he'd be stood in a position where he can see both the path where they join and the gate so sort of build the gate here and then have um, a castle wall out the tower sort of here so then you could spot our, our, any enemies coming this way, spot any enemies coming this way, and also provide. You chopped my trees in a weird order. No, nope, I have done that one. And also provide an extra level of protection from the or for the front door. Let's see if I can work out a design for this. One of my miners has collapsed. Bingo bango, shoe in a best Plenty of wood, so you can build a load of wooden planks. 
got 100 wooden planks and therefore we can get whoops It's a shame that you can't really have the chimney without the furnace inside because he, Olivia really doesn't need a furnace. I do have a lot of people now that aren't really doing anything. Hmm. Hmm. I might. Hmm. Pondering. Okay. So, my new castle gate needs to be four wide. I quite like the idea of having this tower this way. And then that's where I put the door. that one okay I'm gonna pick the wrong brick aren't I brings it up to the right level. You need, oh, you need like three shingles. Where's my actual carpenter? Because you're ruining um, Who is my original carpenter? Oh, uh, sleepy over here. Where are you? All in Cameroon. Ah, uh, has my plan fo been foiled? If I scroll down, you'll see what I mean. I've completed my underground tunnel. But it doesn't appear to work. Because he appears to have spawned on the surface. Rather than next to my... Another oh, bloody spider. No! Stop. Bad David Hammer smash. That's not good. It's not the best news I've ever seen. Stop wherever you're going, David Hammer smash, because I'm going to convert you back to carpenter. You're a disloyal, clumsy, quick learner, though. A carpenter. You. Off you fuck. Because all you are doing is wasting resources. else can we make you you can be my infantryman oh we don't have any of these go and guard the front entrance like a pro so that's an experiment that I have completed that I didn't need to complete uh, an underground tunnel to the edge of the map doesn't work cannot spawn migrants underground which is a bit of a pain in the arse um, but it's tried Ooh, there's more trees for you to chop 
I have plenty for food now. I don't really need or want to get too much food on the go because the more food you have, the more enemies will spawn on the map. So we're li limiting or restricting our amount of food to a reasonable level. It means we can keep slight control over how many enemies there are. So I think 500 is a good level for food. If I can maintain 500 with however many guys I've got now, that'd be pretty cool. Come on, you're racing through those. Bing bong bush. <laughs> Ironically, I just didn't want you to do any work, and now I need you to do work to get to the point where I actually have a front gate. Who else have I got then that I could use as a builder? Hmm. You're another good infantryman as well. Are you going to be a good builder? No. You're a good blacksmith, though. Fell, I don't think you're going to be my builder. Nope. Oh. There's a ladder appeared. You got down, and now you're back up again, you muppet. What are you doing? Let's have a quick search around for any idols that might not... Might be... Good choice for builder. Oh, we've got two Phineas's. Whereas I had two Phineas's. Let's change the farmer genius. Phineas the farmer. Okay, change your name. It's also a classic farmer name. Right, that's good. Total mind blank. Uh, God. Um, let's just go for Lewis. Farmer Lewis. Uh, now that I think about it, I'm going to need to dig out the ground, aren't I? Because I'm going to want to put a proper road underneath the door. Oh, it's all going wrong. My mining army. So for you, you're not going to be doing anything. Why are you not moving? You look pretty, pretty boss in your entire outfit. Oh, I've not really been keeping track of these. Um, I suppose I should check out my herder, because I have read on the forums that the new herder system is not very good, because it means it does your animals just die. No, he appears to be okay. Not really. Oh, there we go. It's a dead chicken. So we have a problem. My herder, oh, a wild chicken. My herder is not. Um, looking after my animals as he should be. They are actually going to slowly die out. Is there another dead chicken there? No, oh, that's alright. So there's a problem. We have a problem with our herder ring, which is not good, because obviously we spent a little bit of time collecting our animals. Can we get you... I mean, bring the chicken outside of the, uh, out of the house now. Excellent. Instantly going to be doing something with it.
I wonder if this will now make my archer tower obsolete. I guess not. It might look fucking horrible. That's the problem. It's going to look absolutely, totally ugly, isn't it? So we'll probably need to put a big fat tower on the end of here. I might go for a circle, actually. Let's trouble this down. Uh, no. I've pressed the Windows key rather than the Alt key. Oh dear. Not not as skillful as I look. So we'll put a nice, maybe nice circle tower on here. So our cobblestone in place. Now that I've got such an army of miners, I'm tempted to do some serious army of minering activities. So you wipe out all of this so that it's all on the same level. I was going to build a little village. So we will. We'll set a load of digging for you to do. Clear all of this out. to work, my team of miners. There's four of you. Where are you going, you moped? What are you doing there? Who's this guy? Hammer smash. Oh, you're my carpenter. You finished building your shingles. Oh, yeah, the roof, are we? Oh, the roof's finished. Good stuff, people. Blacksmith to make a few more hammers while I notice. Can't find hammers now. It's all going wrong. There we go. Another couple of hammers. Silly button clicking. Oops. Mr. Jackson. Sorry, Mr. Jackson. up there. Stop it, game. No need for you to try and do two there. Does that work as a circle? I think it does. Cobblestone in here should be able to put the, the castle gate in. No, oh bollocks! It might be four wide, but does it have to be five wide? I done wrong.
don't know how I would have counted that one block, mate. That's oh shit. What have I done? What have I done wrong? One, two, three, four. That's the right height. That's going to go five high. So it's five high and four wide. It requires a gap in a wall exactly four blocks wide and supports of the hinges must be four blocks minimum. It requires a gap in a wall exactly four blocks wide and supports on the hinges must be four blocks minimum. Why didn't you build the gate? Carpenter, why didn't you build the gate? Oh, fuck's sake, glitch. Good work, Mr. Archer. We now have Castle Gate. What was I pissed about? I wasn't pissed about. I made a mistake and built these two blocks. Lucky with Ben Jackson again, we did. And a merchant has arrived. He's arrived from a logical entrance. We'll just get Ben Jackson to come and sort out. These are the deconstruction of these. really didn't need to use your ladder then. You don't need to use your ladder then, it's one block high. Oops. 
get a few trades. That'd be a good point to call this episode, I think. Oh, something else is being fired. That's something. And killed another one. I'll set bronze for silver because silver is no use. Bronze is. What are you standing on? Sorry, but that's no. Oh, what have you done there? Ah! Couple of Ravenger this time. They're all trying to get in. I think our trader's done there. I think we've had our. Had our fill. Oh no. See, I can't. I can't get out of the fact that that the game doesn't let me do something like that. Well, I think at 27 minutes or so, as we already are, it's a logical point to stop. The trader hasn't yet decided that he's finished. Philippe Archer is going to kill another one for us. And there's another one as well. Except that we are enjoying the wonderful glitch. I just realised I've only got 15 bronze arrows left. Go, 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 go. Yes, I know, I've moved in there deliberately. Nice done. glitch occurred. But that's a good point, I think, to end there, just for now. It's a half an hour long episode, so I hope you've enjoyed the castle building the new front gate entrance making situation. I will finish then by building the completed road or trying to. It didn't, didn't quite do what I wanted it to do. Neither did that. 
It's all going wrong. Half an hour is clearly too long for my game. Reached the half an hour mark exactly at the point. Oh! <laughs> We're getting a new arrival, so I can't end the episode when I wanted to, because I might as well stay and see what this particular lady has to offer. She's clearly offering her lumberjack based services to the settlement. So let's see if she is worth having around. What does she bring with her? Do you want to make much more of an effort to go further in as you possibly can? You're cowardly. Um, you don't really offer me anything, to be fair. Uh, I think I'm actually going to deny you. Go away. Get out of my settlement. Off you fuck. Well, I hope you've enjoyed the episode. I hope you don't mind it's been a bit longer than normal. Um, we are making progress towards having a new, nice, pretty sexy front entrance. That we can hopefully put an archer on this tower. Or two even, perhaps. Maybe one facing this way, one facing this way. And therefore... But I uh, hope you've enjoyed. And I will see you in the next episode. Bye for now, guys.